Carlos and enjoy my Scott Carlos the film I today to show you that I'm doing another project. Uh, this time it's going to be a little the Schlag T-Rex that I got in that bundle some months ago back in March. Um, it's been sitting in my wardrobe, so I thought I'd customize it. Uh, I'm not going to show you what I've custom what I'm going to customize it into until the end. But basically, what I've done here is I'm going to put a base on. So I've done the feet first, and then I've made like made my way down and stuff like that, and made sure it's like all the bottom and some of the sides are done. So hopefully, when the when the feet are dry, I can start doing the um, I can start doing the the rest of the body. What I'm going to try and do is avoid the teeth because I don't want to redo the inside of the mouth. I'm just I just haven't got the the just ugh to do it. So hopefully um, in the next couple of hours, well I should have done like a bit more of it, but we'll have to see. So I'll come back to you in a bit. All right. So this is how it is so far. What I've done with this is that instead of like painting the actual inside of the mouth, I've like painted around it. I think I've done enough, a good enough job, I think, um, because I'm trying to make it like a greenish paint scheme. Um, and you're probably wondering, well, why didn't you just paint it over the green of the uh, actual figure itself? Well, you'll see in the end, because um, there's going to be some needed adjustments. The good thing about this now is that I don't have to paint the... I don't have to paint the claws, you know, so tediously. But I'm definitely going to have to go back over the figure just to make sure there's, there's like, no green left or exposed. Like... Uh, but hopefully this should be done today. If not, then that's fine. Um, so yeah, um, I'll get back to you when I've started painting the base. Right, so so far I've got it propped up on that because it keeps falling over. And um, I've done the underbelly. Um, I've done it white. I've had a bit of brown to it, so it's like it's not totally bleach white, but it's a nice white. But the thing is that this is going to be reduced to kind of a thin line, hopefully, if I can get it done. But uh, yeah, we're going to have to see, so hopefully I'm going to get on with that. And I'm going to see if there's any more black spots, uh, well, well not black spots, I mean uh, spots where there's not going to be black in. But it looks like I've done a pretty good job, so I think I'm going to carry on with that, I'm going to let that dry, and then I'm going to carry on with it after I've uh, let it dry, so I'll see you Here we go, is it so far? Um, I've done an underbelly kind of style to it. Um, I've also put some colour on that, on the side, and I can see it, hang on. I've put. Oh, I'll show you later. But um, obviously, I've done the arms. They're all right. They're nice. Feet are probably gonna. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the feet. Um, it's all the way up to the tail. Uh, then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna apply some green to it. You know, I'll give it a bit of colour. So hopefully, that should be done in a bit. So I'll see. Right, you so we're a bit further on. Um, and as you can see, I've done it green. Um, and all of the feet are done. Uh, so far, and pretty much it's just all you know. All pretty good stuff. Uh, trying to get the underside of the tail, but you know, I put the flash on. Um, this is absolutely this is going good so far. Going good. It's not my best, admittedly. It's not my best, but um, end of the day, it's it, it doesn't really matter. It's not it's not like somebody's gonna go to Papo or Schleich or Safari or Tidy or something like that. But end of the day, um, I'm really happy with how it's coming out so far. So I'll get back to you, uh, maybe tomorrow, because it's getting late and it's going to take me a long time to do this. So yeah, um, I'll get back to you in a bit. Uh, while I'm here, uh, I'll show you what I've been working on while that's been drying and stuff. Uh, a little carcass. Um, it's, yeah, I know, it's terrible. It is actually quite terrible. Uh, basically what I did is I moulded it out of plasticine, um, used a Stanley knife to cut the feet and stuff, and then used Stanley knife to look pretty much just gorge. Just gore it out, you know. It's gonna be like a little carcass that I'm gonna put on that diorama, and you know, I might show you a bit, you know, what it's like. Well, this is it so far. Um, obviously, if you can tell what it is, um, I kind of tried to base it off of the Lost World Jurassic Park Bull T Rex, uh, but as you can see, it's pretty bad. Um, so, yeah, it's not as good as I hoped it would get out, but you know, at the end of the day, I think it looks, it looks alright, it looks good, um, I might try and clear up the spikes, uh, the stripes a bit, I might actually leave them to be honest, because they look quite good, the, the nose looks alright, but I kind of tried to style it on that, and all I gotta do now is do the pupils, and do the scarring on the face, and hopefully it should be done, so yeah, I'll get back to you here's after the that. final product, um, here's your, here's my repaint of the Schleich T-Rex into the, well, pretty much the bull T-Rex from Jurassic uh, Park, The Lost World. Well, sort of a stylized version, um, as you can see there, I've done some, like, scars. What I had to do with that is actually, before I painted it, I actually used that Stanley knife there to gouge some, like, cuts into it. So then it's like, instead of it just being painted on, it's actually, like, gouging into the actual side of the face, which is pretty good. I, I, it'll come out better. Yeah, come out quite, quite a lot good. Well, you know, better than I thought it would. 
Um, stripes on it are okay. I'm actually going to leave them. I actually decided to leave them. Um, and I think I've done a really, really good job with this one. I've actually done... I've, it looks good. Uh, definitely not my best, but you can obviously tell it looks like the Jurassic Park Lost World uh, Bull T-Rex. So that's pretty good. So yeah, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I shall see you later. Bye-bye.